Hello everyone. Today, we the students and clinical instructors of Holy Family Institute of Nursing Education would be demonstrating blood transfusion procedure. Blood transfusion. Blood transfusion is the transfer of blood or blood components from one person, the donor, into the bloodstream of another person, the recipient. What is required? A sterile tray containing IV cannula, anti-allergy drugs, IV flush syringe, cotton balls and gauze piece. Additional articles, sterile glove, blood transfusion set, blood bag, tourniquet, macintosh, kidney tray, IV stand. Procedure. Let's move on to the procedure. Check physician's order, identify patient, second, identify patient, that includes patient's name, date of birth and medical record number. Check blood group, patient's blood type versus the donor's blood type and RH factor compatibility. Ensure availability of blood group with blood bank. Explain procedure to patient. Obtain, obtain consent from patient. Encourage patient to empty bowel and bladder. Ensure privacy. Wash hands. Monitor vital signs. Wear gloves. Insert IV cannula. Inspect blood product that include identification number, blood group, expiry date and abnormal color, clot or excess air. Administer pre-medication if order. Warm the blood bag and make sure it's of body temperature before administration. Connect blood transfusion set to the blood bag. Start blood transfusion slowly for the first 15 minutes. Remain with the patient for the first 15 minutes. This is when most transfusion reactions can occur. Increase the rate of transfusion. After this period, if patient is stable, and doesn't display signs of a transfusion reaction. Monitor vital signs after 15 minutes, then hourly, and finally at the completion of the transfusion. Make sure the entire blood transfusion procedure is complete within four hours. After the blood transfusion, replace articles, wash hands, and document the procedure.